What's up guys? So this is me Victor once again. So today I've basically came to a new location which I've never been before and guess where I am today? Alright, so guys today I'm at yes, this newly opened Fujiwara Tofu shop and yesterday and today was their soft launching and thanks to Hayashi86 for inviting me over to their soft launch. So yeah, now let me bring you guys inside to take a look at what's inside the shop. Alright, first thing first guys, you cannot have an initial D team shop without an A86 sitting inside for sure. So yeah, this is one pretty 86 and then the best part is there are also initial D version 3 arcades lying around that you can enjoy. And there are tons of goodies here which I will go through one by one with you guys right now. Alright guys, so I found something very rare and look at this. Yeah, you can't get any more authentic to the actual manga as this thing. So I believe this is quite a rare item to have. Definitely suit the Initial D team as well. And then you got this Initial D final stage. And yes, they have it as well. So yeah, look at that, look at that. Authenticity man, this is no joke. I wonder how long it took the owner to actually hunt all this down. One more. This one is from the initial D live action movie that stars J Chow. Look, the steering that was used in the movie. I like the similar steering as well. So really, as I say, you cannot get more authentic than this. And of course guys, you have the original A86 steering. And if I'm not mistaken, this is from the Zengi model and this is from the Koki model. So correct me if I'm wrong, but I reckon I'm not. And of course, they do sell some initial D related stuff. We have like, we have these stickers, mark. You can even buy old initial D cards if you want to. There you go, power bank. And this is something rare. The Corolla Levin Spindle Treno Special Edition Bible and it's selling for hmm is it worth it? well it's up to you guys and they have this 86 owners Bible as well and of course the price is is depending on how hardcore you are towards something if you are hardcore enough and this thing is valuable enough for you this price don't mean shit but if you are not into all this kind of thing then this will be ridiculous for you. And this is something rare as well. The Casio G-Shock crossover with Initial D. And the price is right here. So guys, if you're interested, yeah, you know where to find it. And also the Fujiwara Tofu Shop shoes. And of course, you've got a replica of KG Suchia Sunstone 86. Cap from signed by Tech Art. Yeah, during Tech Art's visit to Sepang, Malaysia some cool collectibles and yeah of course they do sell their stuff in bundles as well so yeah if you guys are interested in initial these stuff you guys can definitely hit them up and see one curious question i'm just wondering if all those rims are actually up for sale it will definitely fetch quite an interesting price
I already left Tofu Shop Malaysia. As you can see, I'm now in my car and I'm now currently heading back to Penang because it's getting kind of late. Regarding my thoughts of the shop is, if you are a hardcore Initial D fan, you definitely need to pay a visit. If you guys are not the Initial D fan but just want to try something different, yeah, you could definitely give it a try as well. Regarding food-wise, well, if I compare the food in conjunction with the price, I don't think one can complain much. Uh, of course, you get what you pay for, so that's that. Would I come back? Yeah, definitely. If I come to KL again and I have the time, I definitely would pay another visit because I'm a big Initial D fan myself. And before I end this video, I would like to thank Hayashi86 for inviting me to the soft loss of the shop today. So yeah, thank you Hayashi86. So alright guys, that's all for this episode today. I'll see you guys next time. Thank you.